I wanna walk you through five key things that I do every single day to help keep me productive and motivated and to ultimately lead my best, healthiest lifestyle. everybody and welcome back to another Abigail Page Designs YouTube video. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. I decided to change things up and instead of a normal vlog, I wanted to do kind of a self-help video. I would like to start this off with a disclaimer. I am not a professional by any means. I am not a doctor. I am not a nutritionist. I am not any of the above. Uh, this is all simply from my own personal perspective and what I think helps me. Today, I want to walk you through five key things that I do every single day to help keep me productive and motivated and to ultimately lead my best, healthiest lifestyle. If you see me glance down occasionally, I do have some notes just so that way I can kind of stay on point here. I don't want to bore you with a 30 minute video and I am very, very good at that. So <laughs> I wanted to stay on task today. Without further ado, let's jump into those five things. Number one is morning exercise I or morning activity, whatever you want to call it. I feel like this could look different for everybody. For me personally, I like to start my day off with either a morning run, yoga, a good weightlifting session at the gym, just something to get me moving. The time spent doing that is anywhere from 30 minutes to like two hours. For some, that may be too much. And... I totally get that. Even if you fit in like a five minute walk, I swear on my life that just getting out and moving your body really helps to set the tone for the rest of the day. It also shows that you're, you know, dedicated to you and you put yourself forward before any other of those tasks that must be done daily. I honestly think that is what has helped me to be so incredibly productive throughout my days. Let's just say endorphins are a real thing. <laughs> they definitely keep you happy and upbeat and help you to go on with the rest of your day. Number two is proper fuel and hydration. Now, when I say fuel, I mean food. There was a time in my life where I thought that, you know, taking a break and eating a snack or eating lunch was counter productive. Like I didn't have the time to do that. However, I'm here to tell you that will drain you out really quickly and it's just not healthy guys. Make sure you are staying properly fueled and hydrated. Water is so important. It helps keep you in, you know, your brain thinking. It helps to keep your body and your skin and your hair and everything good. So please, please, please make sure you're fueling and hydrating, especially in the summer. Number three is keep things clean and organized. If I don't have a clean space, then I cannot function. I can't think. I get distracted easily. It stresses me out. So I do try to a lot, at least five minutes to 30 minutes of cleaning in my day, whether it be picking up my clothes and putting them back in my drawers or wiping down my vanity. Just making sure that you take time to clean and organize. Now I know some people this may not be the case and you do truly function better when you can see everything, you're very visual. Uh, but if you're like me and kind of a clean freak, <laughs> then keeping a clean space will help you immensely in staying productive and on task. Number four, and this one may sound a little weird, but it is Wear outfits that make you feel good. This may not be the case for some dudes. I don't know. Maybe you do also have the same thing. I find that when I am getting myself ready for the day and I'm putting on an outfit that makes me feel good and I'm doing my hair and I'm doing my makeup, it helps to get me in a different mind space. If I was wearing sweatpants or something, that just makes me want to sit on the couch and watch a movie. Whereas if I'm getting ready and I'm looking cute, then I feel like I can accomplish the world. I try to set a rule with myself that I'm not allowed to like wear sweatpants or sweatshirts or anything until after four o'clock p.m. I know that's 
kind of strange, a weird time, but by then I'm like, okay, you can start to calm down for the day. Before then, I should be wearing something that is kind of a little more motivating. And especially if you work from home, I find this to be a huge, huge, huge lifesaver. When you're home, it can be really easy to blur the lines between work time and, you know, chill time. So you got to find a way to separate them and putting on a business casual outfit will help you do that. Number five is so, so, so important. And I am not going to lie. I'm not always the best at this, but I have been trying to get better. And that is get enough sleep. Sleep <laughs> is so important. It helps to keep you, your mind healthy. It helps to keep your body healthy. I can tell you from experience that, you know, when you're running on six, seven hours of sleep, you're just not in a good headspace. And so I try to get at least eight plus hours of sleep. For some of you, you might need less, you might need more, depending on how active you are or what your job is or any of that. But for me, it is eight or more hours. Last night, I actually got nine or 10. It was very refreshing and I feel amazing today. So I think that people can really, especially when you're my age, you know, 18 to 25, it's so easy to be like, nope, it's okay. I can survive off four hours of sleep. Please, please, please get enough sleep. In case you're wondering, yes, my lovely rooster just was like, amen, sister. <laughs> he probably gets a solid 10 to 12 hours of sleep as but well. But yeah, all of that said, that was my five keys to having a productive, motivated, healthy lifestyle. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below any tips you might have so that way we can share and converse about different things that all of us do to just keep chugging along. <laughs> all right, I love you guys and I will see you next week. Bye.